Count yourself blessed. If you are still here and you have your family members still here, nobody passed away, thank you, Jesus. I'm not going to knock on wood, but I'm just going to give God his praise and honor that he deserves for keeping us. My love bugs and love muffins, it's Mama Love. And welcome back to my channel. And today is a very exciting day for me because it is, first of all, it's Sunday. Hint, hint. Yes, it's Sunday and my mama is going to be preaching today and I am going to go support my mom. And um, she is an uh, anointed speaker and she will be speaking to uh, in Jackson, Michigan this morning. And um, I just, I'm looking for a miracle because y'all, I have not been inside the church building like for seven months and um it's really really exciting for me and um i mean i ain't had no sleep last night i didn't go to sleep i didn't go to sleep but i stayed up y'all i stayed up because i did not want to oversleep so i want y'all to stay tuned because we are in for a time this morning high time in god okay you all we just pulled up here at greater Bible Way Temple in Jackson, Michigan. So excited. Ain't been in the house of the Lord. Like I said, seven months, y'all. About to go. I hope I, I hope I ain't too late. Jesus. Stay tuned.
gave one of the most electrifying, fascinating testimonies in the history of the New Testament church. It comes to us from Pontiac, Michigan. He is the assistant pastor to the honorable and distinguished, gifted, and brilliant, intelligent Southern Bishop Wilbur Reed. He's married to. So what's up, love bugs? So I'm back because you know my, I said that my mother was supposed to minister today, but somehow it did not turn out that way. She ended up praying for people. Yeah, we had another minister. So I went live instead. So you guys saw the live feed of the ministering, and my mother had just done, you know, prayer. Uh, she did the prayer um, of land on hands. So we're just out right now at um, the Chop House in Ann Arbor. I just want to show you the restaurant without with some of the saints, and we're out with Bishop Bishop Combs. Oh, you're beautiful. Look at you. Want to see yourself? Look at. Look at Isn't that? And she's shining. Isn't this exquisite? Look, I got that. Look, that's my uh. Germix right there, look, we, we carried up in here. So we had a wonderful service today and I was just glad to be back in the house of the Lord after seven months. <laughs> yeah, seven months, but yeah. God is good. And even though I'm at this nice, elegant restaurant, I'm still gonna be nice and I'll be showing you what I'm going to be ordering. And so stay tuned because the food is not here and I have not made a decision yet. Yeah. Okay, y'all, so here I am trying to stay away from carbs and they come over here with these dainty bread muffins and the butter and oh, I can't have it. You all, I will not eat that piece of bread. I will not eat, pay attention, I will not eat the bread. <laughs> I don't kill that bread. I'm not gonna eat it, y'all. I can't eat it. Get it off in front of me. Jesus, please, God. My Lord Jesus. Y'all, let me just smell it. Oh, my Lord. I can't do it. Oh, God, please. I'm not gonna do it. They laughing, but I'm serious. So. Bishop then brings us over here to this chop house in Ann Arbor where a piece of chicken costs $30. He didn't got bougie on us, right? <laughs> but I can roll with the big dog. Watch me, ro watch me roll with him. Watch, watch me roll with him. I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna give me two pieces of chicken. Mm. I'm gonna pay $60 for two pieces of chicken. <laughs> I'm so tired. I'm going to McDonald's. I'm fine. <laughs> no, I'm gonna roll with the big girl. Watch, watch me do this. I'm gonna find some on that menu, honey. I'm give me a ribeye steak. Do they bring salad? Pass the gravy. Hmm. Bougie. How much is the salad? Forty. Twenty nine ninety nine for for pan seared chicken. By itself, that's it. No sides, no nothing. How much was this? Your crab cakes. Nineteen ninety-five. Nineteen ninety-five with some crab cakes. And a bowl of mashed potatoes for nine ninety-five. But Bishop said he was paying, so I'm eating. I should have got a steak. I should have gotten a steak. <laughs> <laughs> I know, he big balling over there. Get what you want. Send him the bill, he said. He said, get what you want, send him the bill. I'm good. I'm gonna be good. Thank you, Bishop. <laughs> okay, do it, do it, do it. Cause we gotta act like that up in here. Come on. It's so bougie. It's so bougie. Do it, do it, do it, do it. How you do it? I have my stick. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have my steak, please. <laughs> Great poupon. Okay, so here's my most elegant chicken I ever saw. <laughs> my spinach. And, a, and what are that? Salmon patties. Those are salmon patties? Mm -hmm. Let me get a close-up on those with that. 
run it up to you. Oh wow. Elegant. Yeah, Ooh. And the mashed potato. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. So just giving y'all a little so we're trying to guess these pictures you say what about a thousand dollar or more yeah because I look at the frame on it well you all I pulled back up at home made it safe it was a drive Jackson, Michigan is quite a ways, but I made it home safe and I thank God for the service today. Thank God for the word. Thank God for prayer. And I thank God for the dinner. We got treated out. Bishop treated us out. Thank God, y'all. Um, I'm sleepy now. I'm going to end this vlog off, so you all be blessed and peace out in Jesus name.